The pandemic has added a layer of complexity to events large and small, including a track and field competition at the Armory in Washington Heights. Yes, uh, young athletes are back in action after a long pandemic pause earlier this year. CBS 2's Tony Aiello reports tonight. It's the sound that signals a welcome day of top competition, the Marine Corps Holiday Classic at the Armory in Washington Heights. The pandemic presenting many hurdles for high school track and field stars. It's definitely been hard. Uh, we don't know if our program is going to get shut down for a week or two. Uh, when you can't practice with your team, our performance really suffers. It's the second pandemic for the 110-year-old Armory after the Spanish flu of 1918. Earlier this year, the pandemic canceled the premier indoor track event here, the Milrose Games. The armory was being used for a different kind of shot putting. As in putting shots in more than 100,000 arms over four months as a vaccine center. With a restart of competition, layers of precautions here include double vaccine and mask mandates, constant surface sanitizing, and open windows to promote healthy airflow. We have gone from being the fastest track in the world to being known as the coldest track in the world now. Armory Foundation VP Rita Finkel is amazed at the spirit shown by athletes who've powered through pandemic challenges. I couldn't be around my team, so I just like did workouts around my block. No matter your obstacle, I think you should still get what you can out of the situation. It's dedication, it's determination, it's discipline, and they have all those qualities that they can really apply to anything in their lives. There's hope here the pandemic finish line is in sight. We made it through. That's the main thing. And why we made it through is because of all the people that work together to try to get things done. In Washington Heights, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. Five athletes went home with awards from the Marines in balancing athletics and academics. They attend Bronx Science, Mount Vernon, Valley Stream, South, Baldwin, and Elmont Memorial High Schools. Way to go. Congrats to all of them. Great job.